Hi everyone, my name is TJ Johnson and I am a first grade teacher at Lewis and Clark Elementary School in um, Liberty, Missouri. Um, I'm currently dog sitting um, on my spring break, so if you hear some toys during the video, I apologize. Um, one of the single most important traits I think I need to cultivate um, to be successful in the next stage of my career, whatever that might be, whether that is in administration or something else in education, um, is to be brave and be willing to take risks. Um, sometimes I play it safe, um, but I think that in order to um, make bigger steps, bravery will need to uh, be put in place. So um, the big aha moment when I realized differences between administrators and teachers is that really administrators are um, like teachers. Their, their, um, their classroom is just their school and they are overseeing the happiness of their educators as well as the happiness of parents um, and the involvement of their students' education. So um, that was a big aha, but also being a teacher during the pandemic, like starting off as a teacher during a pandemic um, and seeing how educators were having to guess, but really the school leaders were having to guess as well. Um, that was what stood out to me the most, especially during this um, year of the program. Um, finally, the overview for my capstone is I am planning on um, really watching and seeing um, the impact that the phonics program that our building has put in place will make on students um, when taking the state's um, assessment, so the MAP assessment. How does the impact of our phonics program, Orton-Gillingham-based, um, it's backed, supported by... Um, many scholars that it is successful. I've seen it, it's working, it's doing great, um, but I wanna see if that impact is carrying through um, multiple grades and how positively or negatively it is impacting our state assessment scores. So um, the reason why I'm doing it is because our state assessment scores and math are really great. And um, when it comes to reading though, we tend to drop off in the third, fourth, fifth grade, which is when we start our state assessment scores. So. Um, I'm looking forward to this next two months, and I know it's going to be rigorous, but I'm looking forward to it and ready to graduate. So um, go Bearcats, and good luck to everyone else.